going to you end? Hi, baby. Yeah, how are you? Huh? You're a good boy. <laughs> okay. Hello, everyone. My house is a total disaster, but I wanted to show you some of these great meat deals that I found today. And a couple of them I found the other day. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, there is cheese and grime and grit in my freezer. That's because my husband has been spending more time up here. Um, we cleared out this bottom and we had all of oven kind of foods. He's been having fun with it, but you know what? It's time to stock up on some meat. Now, I still have not got into my big freezer because he had this jam-packed, but now I've got it jam-packed again, and I'm going to show you how I buy meat right now. Look at Kroger. Look at your Kroger affiliates. Go through. Just take a look. Take a gander. Um, I would suggest going between 10 and 1 o'clock in the afternoon one day. Um, that's when your produce people are putting their... Uh, reduced produce down, the meat department, the dairy department, all your departments are going to be marking stuff down. It's going to be ready and rock and roll by the time you get in there. And hopefully not too many hands have gotten there first. All right. Now to some great deals that I found. Okay. Bacon. This is the uncured hardwood smoked bacon. It was reduced to $1.99 it is normally $5.99. Yes, these are 12 ounce packets. Normally $6 a package. I got them for $1.99. I got four of them. I've got two more of them shoved up in there. Um, this is so funny because, I mean, I see this and I'm like, no brainer. It's going in my cart. I'll get as many as I can um, because you never know. Okay. Total lady who was shopping down there and she says, Oh, okay, just leave me a few. I left her three. I took four. And when she got down there, she's like, oh, I don't eat that kind of bacon. Excuse me, <laughs> for $1.99 a package, I will eat that bacon. The only thing that I won't get a whole lot of is if it's sweet, maple flavored. I might get one because my husband will not eat maple flavored meat like sausage and bacon and all of that stuff. No, thank you for him. Okay, so they had sausage patties. They also had some links for 99 cents a piece. These are normally $2.50 a package. I mean, come on, not a bad deal. So I got three of those. I got three of them. So we've got bacon, we've got sausage, and yes, for some families, that's not going to feed you very long. But for the two of us, it's it's a fantastic deal. Um, I will break some of these packages down and get them repackaged very, very soon. Okay, so I found this chicken breast. It was $6.83. It was normally $10.52. I went ahead and got it. That's two, four, that's five large chicken breasts for $6.53. So I thought, you know what, I'll package them up in meals and we'll do that. Now up there, there are some roasts and things that I did find on clearance quite a while ago, but I'm not going to get into those. Okay, something else I found today. I found there were two of these. Okay, I only grabbed one because this one had more of a redder meat. The other one looked like it might have been packaged a little older. So I did only pick up one of these. That would be half off. So there are 10 pre-made patties. You know, I mean, if we get deciding maybe we want cheeseburgers one night, what I'm going to do is package these into um, twos. And if we decide we want double cheeseburgers or if we just want a cheeseburger, maybe make some patty melts, you know, some kind of fancy burger or something, or maybe a steak type burger. Um, what... A great deal to have these so we'll pre-package these in um, smaller packaging okay um i think that's all i found today now i do have meat in here that i i found other times other places um there's some boneless skinless uh chicken thighs there's some uh boneless skinless chicken breasts in there that i got really really cheap at aldi um, and at Walmart and some at uh, Kroger. So I'm constantly looking for roasts. Um, 
But all of this chicken back here, I found it last week. Um, I gave myself $50 last week. I gave myself $50 this week. Um, I'm already at the limit for this week for groceries. But with these meat deals, I could not, I couldn't pass it up. So I've got chicken here. It's ready to rock and roll in prepackaged areas. Now these are T-bones. <laughs> and I got these for um, our New Year's Eve night. He and I, we do surf and turf, mostly seafood stuff. But I found these T-bones and I was like, you know what? This is going to be our New Year's steaks. So this is a T-bone I got for um, $12.09 and it was normally $18.69 and it's an Angus. This was at Remke Market um, down in Ohio. Um, I go down there to get cheaper feed. Um, so this one was $9.67 and was normally $14.95. So you know what? The way I see it, I got us a couple of steaks for 20 bucks. You know, not a bad deal. Not really. Okay, let me show you these uh, roasts. This one here is the Choice Beef Shoulder Pot Roast. Okay, and I got it for... 1054 and it was normally and it don't have that price on there but just think of it as half off it was like 20 something dollars um here's another one <laughs> look at my freezer is two of these little roasts for 1103 and they were normally 2301 i mean that's a good savings i don't care if you think well I'm not going to get the marked down meat because I have to do something with it right away. What? You can't go and put it in the freezer or go put it in your crock pot or your pot and cook it? Uh, yeah, you can. <laughs> and you should. So that's how I shop for meat. That's how I save money on meat. Um, I saw these. And for us here at lunch, like the two girls and I, these are a meatless chicken patty. There's four of them in there. And they were 99 cents. They say this corn brand is pretty good. But I thought, you know what? We'll test drive them. If the girls don't like them and I don't like them, trust me, the chickens will eat it all. Um, I also found fruits and vegetables. I have been buying a lot of greens. Um, salads. I'm trying to lose a little weight <laughs> right now. Um, it's one of the goals that the surgeon gave me. I have gained quite a bit of weight in the past couple of months, and it is not flattering. So it's time to get that under control. I'm trying to get this so I can show you some of the other things that I got. I'll have this all fixed back up here in a little bit. So let's just make sure that this closes. <laughs> this is probably the least filled my freezer has been. If you notice, there are some snacky foods up here. I still have a lot of meat and vegetables up there. We still have a bunch of cheese. It's time to start shredding these blocks. Um, and then I still have some vegetables, some fruits I've been putting up here, some yeast, um, some tortillas, just my mainstay of whatever's right there. Okay, so now let's look here. I'm gonna show you something. I got three of these. These are the Simple Truth um, organic milks. They were $2.99 marked down from $5.99 and they are on the buy one or buy five or more and save a dollar. So each one of those gallons of milk ended up being $1.99 and I don't know if I've told you but I do make my own cheese um, and if this was whole milk I probably make a little cheese out of it. But what I'm going to do is just simply feed it to my chickens. You know, we've got the temperature dropping again. We were up to 60 yesterday. We're down in the 30s today and horrible winds. So yes, they will be getting the milk. Um, I found collard greens for 60 cents a bag and uh, turnip greens for 60 cents a bag. So what I'm going to do is half of those are going to go to make us some turnips and mustard greens and then half will go to the chickens and duck okay so these hot dog buns are 90 cents 
marked down. I had a dollar off too, which made them 49 cents a piece or something like that. 40 cents a piece. Great deal. And even if we don't use them or eat them, my chickens will. What a great little uh, garlic loaf that is. If you have kids, they can have their own garlic bread. You know, you find cheap stuff like that. Okay, I was looking at the, t the oranges. I'm trying to get my husband to eat more oranges. These were 99 cents a bag. And the cheapest ones they had were $2.49. So for $2.89, I got this more than what was in the other little bag. Plus, these are riper, more ripe. Sorry, not riper. Well, riper might be a word. I don't know. But <laughs> these are more ripe. They're more juicy. They're more flavorful. And so we'll be eating oranges is our mainstay fruit for this week. Um, I did get us some reduced bananas. Those are organic. Um, I think I only paid like, I don't know, $1.50 for them on, on reduced. So there you go. That's how I shop. Um, I don't know if I told you a couple of weeks ago that I found bag, three pound bags of sweet potatoes for a dollar a bag, um, at Rural King. So <laughs> I hope I can find that again, which I probably will never be able to find that again, but I still have some in the uh, back of my truck. So I haven't had to buy sweet potatoes for my girls or for my meals. So we're still good on that. And I hope everyone had a great Thanksgiving. Um, I hope everybody's getting ready for Christmas. You know, Merry whatever, right? Okay. Well, you all have a great day. Hugs from a distance. Stay safe. You know that there are some respiratory stuff going on. There's a lot of public shootings going on. Be safe. Be prepared. Get what you need in your freezer. Get all your staples that you need and get ready. <laughs> Bye, y'all.